Hi, this is Shane Veronica. Now, yesterday I got a list of oil and gas and petroleum, whatever you may call it there in Barbados, everything is going up. Now, today you're seeing that even the petroleum companies are running out of gas. Not only are they running out of gas, they are on the brink of running out of business. Now, any gas station, anyone who undertakes establishing a gas station, you have to come up with a whole lot of money. That's something that you know from day one, anyone or any organization that deals in gas, petroleum or selling things like that. It's a lot of money to, even the startup part of it is a lot of money. So when you hear that three are closed right now in Barbados and some are thinking about going out of business altogether because since the pandemic they're still struggling and you know they they cannot afford to buy gas is that what I'm hearing that they cannot even afford to buy gas to sell to people who come into the stations to buy gas and over 100 people so far are on the bread line is that what we're hearing so listen up, people in Barbados, gas companies are going out of business. The gas companies are going out of business, can't pay the rent, don't have no gas in the tank, nothing. They're going out of business. Everyone is hurting. So when people pretend that they're, you know, doing well within the situation that's going on here in the world, you know, they're lying. Okay. They're lying. Everyone is feeling it. Everything is up, up, up. Everyone is hurting in some way. Somewhere along the line, you'll find yourself saying, not getting that anymore. I'm going to pass on that. You find yourself negotiating things that were common, you know, common nature before. Now you have to think about how you spend your money and what you're going to keep, you know, for that rainy day. You have to negotiate how you spend your money. Gas stations in Barbados are on the brink of going out of business. Sure, Veronica.